Hi, Diego and Tribal here for Frog TV. I love conventional food. The smell of pesticides on the lettuce. The tangy taste of herbicides on the cereal. And I love strawberries. So sweet, so juicy. Wait, what did you say? Diego, you've been talking to a master of disguise. An endocrine disruptor. <sighs> Diego, are you paying attention? Hmm? Oh. Endocrine disruptors. Chemicals sprayed on different crops that have been chemically castrating and mutating frogs. Apparently they're also good mimics. That's right, Diego. And those strawberries you just ate are filled with them. Isn't it exciting, Diego? There are endocrine disruptors entering your body right now. Let's follow them and see what they're up to. Okay. Is that my blood? Yes, Diego. And those blue things are your hormones. They bind to your cells and give your body instructions to grow or change. But those aren't hormones. They look like... Yes, endocrine disruptors. They're binding to my cells! The endocrine disruptors are in the driver's seat now, Diego. Who knows what they'll tell your body to do? Early exposure to endocrine disruptors could result in autism, obesity, and abnormal sexual development, among other things. All from that strawberry? It's not the strawberry, Diego. It's the pesticides. You'd be surprised how much of the food we eat contains endocrine disruptors. And not just fruits and vegetables, even packaged foods like cereal or meat. And that concludes today's report. Endocrine disruptors. They mimic hormones and tell our cells what to do. They create all kinds of problems in our bodies, and our food is filled with them. This is Tribal and Diego for Frog TV. Find out how you can avoid endocrine disruptors from pesticides. Visit Frog TV on the web at frogtv.com.